Doorways are passageways. Our front door moves us from the outside world with its busyness and expectations into our home. With one or two steps, we enter the space where we belong. In our home, we have the opportunity and responsibility to form and inform our children and our family. Our home is a sanctuary. It is set apart. Hi, I'm Brian. And I'm Tiffany. And these are all our five boys. We are a real, actual family. Welcome. It is such a joy to be with you. We hope to encourage you and inspire you to bring this program to life in your homes. For our family, faith is a journey we walk daily. We try to find God in all different types of situations, whether it be in the news or anything we encounter in the day. We talk about God with our children and we make time for prayer whenever we can. We try to be intentional about that time also. We visit the sacraments, mass once a week, but it's very important for us that we schedule those times to pray together as a family. And our children know that when we come together, that there's a certain time when we pray and that time is for God. We're gonna guide you through what a family meeting looks like and give you the tools to be successful and feel confident in your own family. And how are we gonna do that? By demonstrating with tips and guiding you through modeling these meetings with our own family. And there's no perfect way to do it. Just stick with it and it'll bear fruit. Every family meeting follows the same structure. Gather, family check-in, activity, teaching, and prayer. Ritual is important. It provides a safe and consistent space we can rely on. Decide on a specific day and time that works best for your family. As a family, we learn from one another. Each person will bring something important to the conversation. Create an area that feels cozy. Think lots of pillows and blankets. Children benefit from quality time with family, so you can set a space that encourages them to sit close together and lean into your conversations with one another. The content has been written to help your family encounter Jesus. We will look at his teachings, leadership, and servant heart to help us understand what it means to follow him. We learn the most when we have to teach. As parents, this will be a time of growth for you too. You're invited to look over the meeting cards or the content online beforehand and make the content your own. The language provided is a model, but each family is different and you know your children best. Some meetings will go great and some will be a struggle. We don't give up on taking our children to practice when one game doesn't go well. The same goes for our faith life. If it is important to us, we will continue to pursue it. Consistency is key. You'll start to look forward to your weekly time together and take your time. It is the one thing we cannot make more of or get back. And if your children are like our children, they really appreciate a special dessert at the end. This program can be used like a script. Follow it word for word or add your own words. Add your own experiences to each meeting. In the next video, we will do a family meeting with you. So don't worry. So ask yourselves first, why is faith important? And is it important to my family? It's not just what we do, but it's the essence of who we are. For us, we want our children to embody the values of Jesus. But that doesn't happen unless we are intentional. We make time for things that are important. Thank you for making this important. And just remember, one meeting is not going to change your entire family. But being consistent will allow you to create a rhythm, to talk about your faith, to pray together, and to learn more about Jesus. So as you go forth and begin this journey with your family, take courage in the words of Pope St. John Paul II when he said the future does not belong to those with power or money, but to those with children. <laughs> you are forming the next generation of disciples. <laughs>